following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, from Death Valley, weighing in at 305 pounds, The Undertaker. everybody's attention who just like to remind you that I weigh in tonight at 246 pounds I hail from Green Bay Wisconsin Mr. Inside the head of 
his opponent. If you can keep your cool and keep your, you know, keep your head together in the ring with him, you're halfway home. But you're not taking into account the power and experience of the dead man task. Surely you can't forget about that. Well, you see, that's the other 50%, Cole. Good luck with that, if you know what I'm saying. And by the way, let me ask you a question. You call me Shirley? since the beginning who you're rooting for. I never claim to be completely objective, Taz. It's no secret I respect superstars who stick within the rules and show some sportsmanship in the ring. You gotta understand, Cole. I know it ain't exactly kosher, but you're putting your body on the line in there. You gotta do whatever it takes to protect yourself and pick up the win. Taz, you're talking about two... Submission hold locked in. We may see a tap out right here. And even if you can't make your opponent tap out, this will take a lot of fight out of him. And there's the submission hold. What a deadly maneuver this is. You're not kidding, Cole. Man, this, I'll tell you what, man. This one's just turned into a fight. You're on simple. We knew it was going to be intense. We knew it was going to be physical. But I don't think anyone was prepared for this. I gotta admit, it kind of took me by surprise, Cole. That don't happen too often. That's an understatement. You've been in hundreds of matches in your career. We both called hundreds more. We usually have a pretty good idea of what to expect, but not this time. He ain't taking any chances with this submission, Cole. Look at how tight he's got it locked in. I see that, Taz. I wouldn't be surprised if he got his opponent to tap out right here. Oh my, the submission hold is locked in. And this ain't easy to get out of either, Cole. He smells blood in the water, Cole. He's going straight for the submission. And this could prove to be a decisive moment in this match. What a submission maneuver. You must be familiar with this one, Taz. Yeah, I've been on both sides of it, Cole. That's the truth. And let me tell you, it's better to give than receive. Whoa! I think these fans have got a little something they want to share with us. That's their right, Taz. They paid for their tickets, after all. tough job. I mean, trying to keep these superstars on the up and up, that's hard. Well, it's easier to get some superstars to play by the rules than others. Hey, you know what, Cole? If you're gonna get on your high horse again and give us another lecture about playing fair, I swear to God, I'm gonna throw up. Is it so wrong to ask a superstar to play by the rules, Taz? That doesn't seem to be so unreasonable to me. That's because you never competed in a match, Cole. If you did, you'd know that you gotta do whatever it takes to win. And if that means bending the rules a bit, well then, that's just the way the cookie crumbles. Oh my, there's the submission hold. He's in the driver's seat now. No doubt, Cole. If your opponent lets you lock that in, it usually means that they ain't got much left. He's going for the submission. And he might get it. He's got that hold locked in. He knows his opponent is completely helpless to resist the submission hold. And that means you gotta either dig deep and find a way to break it, or you gotta just flat out tap out. There are a lot of superstars in the back who'd like to shut Ken Kennedy's mouth once and for all. I ain't disagreeing with you, but there's a huge difference between wanting to do that and being able to pull that off. Here it is, Taz. He's building up a head of steam, and he's about to let his opponent have it. I'll tell you what, if his opponent's got a brain in his head, he'll get the heck out of there. You know, instead of showboating to the fans, maybe you should really keep your head to this match. Come on, Taz. You're looking at a superstar who can feed off a crowd and use that energy to win the match. I think we're hearing the First Amendment in action here tonight, Taz. It's a great thing to hear, Cole. I'm all in favor of freedom of expression, whether I agree with what they're saying or not. I hope this 
This isn't the last time. Jeez, do you see what I'm seeing? I don't think this arm's got much left. And that seems to be a part of the game plan, Taz. Soften up that arm and make it into a weak spot. that if one of these superstars successfully executes their finishing move, this one is over. That ain't necessarily the case, Cole. Just because it's called the finisher doesn't mean it always ends the match. You sound like you're speaking from experience here, Taz. Of course not. Whenever I locked in the Taz mission, that was it. End of story. It was over. I think you're developing a selective memory in your old age, partner. Superstars give everything they got when they're in a match like this. But a lot of people don't realize what they sacrifice behind the scenes also. No question. If you want to make it in the WWE, you've got to sacrifice just about everything for your career. It has to be as important to you as anything else in your life. So what you got to realize, to make it in the WWE, this is not a job. This is a lifestyle. That's why you see so much passion for what they do in the ring. And that's something you won't see anywhere else. With all due respect to every athlete and entertainer out there, no one gives as much of themselves to their fans as the WWE superstars. There's not a superstar in the locker room who can afford to ignore these fans, Cole. You're right about that. Without the fans, we'd all be out of a job. is one of the most impressive superstars ever to set foot in the WWE ring. But you know what? Oh, you're only as good as your last match. How can you say that, Taz? The dead man has proven himself time and time again. I highly doubt that that would change if he lost this match, which I don't think he's in danger of doing, by the way. Take has earned his rep. No doubt about that. No one's disputing that. But you gotta know when to call it a day, Cole. There's a fine line between legend and has been. Look at these fans. They didn't like that one bit. Yeah, well, you know what? I got some bad news for these fans. He don't give a damn what you think. in this match. It sure could. There's a lot of pressure being applied in that hole, Cole. <laughs> Mr. Kennedy's my kind of guy. He'll talk smack right to your face, and he can back it up with his body in that ring. He certainly isn't shy about sharing his opinions, that's for sure. But I, for one, could do without that enormous ego of his. What a deadly submission hold this is. We might see a tap out right here. It wouldn't surprise me one bit. The longer you stay in this, the more risk you have to serious injury. Oh, man. This is just about the last hold you want to find yourself in. I can imagine. Just look at the pressure being applied here. And the crowd has come alive tonight with a chant directed at the superstars in the ring. Yeah, and you can't let that break your focus. But that's easier said than done. Man, I almost feel bad for JR and King, Cole. When's the last time you think they saw a match this good? I couldn't tell you, Taz. I don't know if they've ever had anything this good on Raw. Yeah. Me neither. Because I guess that just makes sense. I mean, after all, SmackDown is the number one brand in all of sports entertainment. And that's one of the few things we completely agree on, partner. It doesn't get any bigger or better than SmackDown. He slipped out of that one. there's ever been a more dominant superstar in WWE than the legendary Deadman, The Undertaker. 
Yeah, but you can only stay on top of the mountain for so long. And the dead man's been there for a very, very long time. That might be true, Taz, but I don't see anyone on the horizon who could dethrone the Phenom. Man, this match is so good, it's even worth sitting next to you to watch it, Cole. Yeah, thanks a lot, Taz. He may get the three count right here. Your winner, The Undertaker!